Welcome back. Did you know that there is a conference aimed at educating Americans on the problem of white privilege. Well, at the 16th annual conference taking place this week in Kentucky, activist Leonard Zeskin said that white privilege stems from the bald-faced racists of the Tea Party. This is what he said. This is a quote. All this business about government and constitutional is a smokescreen that's really all about, I want this country back for me, and me meaning white people. I don't think I have to convince you that they have that sort of generic racism. Well, Eric Owens, education editor from The Daily Caller, was the only journalist there, and he joins us now with his first-hand account. Eric, welcome. Thank you. Happy Pi Day. <laughs> Thanks a lot. So, Eric, tell me about this room. What was the room like when you go in there and you're hearing somebody on the stage say that the Tea Party is a bunch of racists? Well, it was during, um, uh, uh, there were several sessions going on at the same time, and I chose this one because uh, I was very sure, based on last year, that there would be uh, fireworks, because Zeskin kind of has the same spiel every year. And uh, it was an overflow crowd. Um, virtually everyone there was white. Um, people were sitting on the ground. And, you know, he came in and, and um, you know, he kind of gave his, his spiel, which you summed up very nicely. And why is it that they call it the White Privilege Conference, Eric? Well, one of the things you know, I'm focusing on as I'm reporting on this is some of the crazier things that people say. Uh, there is reasonable people. There are reasonable people there. The, the, their concept is that uh, because of white people have a certain skin color, they carry around an invisible knapsack of privileges that only they can see, um, and that there's a institutional racism which is just abundant and um, huge in society. Uh, so they come together and, and kind of talk about it in a really patronizing way. And so they're patronizing the Tea Party, but you think that some of these people, some of these very progressive members of this, uh, this group that gets together to talk about white privilege have actually infiltrated the Tea Party? Yeah, well, that's, that's Zeskin's claim. And so what he, he says that he's spent his life covering um, or documenting, you know, these crazy, detestable white supremacist movements um, and sort of a sleight of hand, really, what he's saying is that these groups have infiltrated the Tea Party, which a Tea Party person reminded me in an email yesterday, the Tea Part stands for tax enough already. Um, but his contention is that uh, people who are involved in the Tea Party ha don't really care about economics. They're consumed by race. Um, they're amenable to, um, you know, white racists who are just lunatic French people and that those people have kind of come together. So however many millions of Tea Party people are being led around by, a, you know, racist loons. Eric Owens, the only guy who was inside the room when all this stuff was being said. Thank you very much for sharing your story with us this morning from Louisville. Thank you.